What's going on everyone, you already know, this is your boy Juan, and in today's video, I'm going to give you guys a look at my desk setup that I will be using throughout the year of 2018. Working and editing videos on the laptop can be tedious at times, especially after a few hours of work. The eyes get tired, and finding a comfortable position can be difficult. So I wanted to build a comfortable workspace where I could sit down and work on my videos without all the other drawbacks. The result was this beautiful modern desk setup. As you can see, I am going for a black, silver, gray, matte theme that seems minimal, but at the same time, is super functional. Okay, so let's start by talking about the desk. The desk is from Walker Edison Furniture Company, which I bought online at Home Depot. Constructed of thick tempered safety glass and steel frame together create a sturdy stylish workspace. It features a large wood storage drawer to maintain a neat appearance and it has a classic X frame leg design and a sleek finish. The desk is 48 inches by 31 inches which is big enough to fit all our gear but it's not too big where it takes up most of the space. It looks great in the living room and it fits the theme well. Up next let's talk about the monitor. Here we have a 32 inch UHD Samsung monitor with quantum dot display. The monitor delivers incredibly sharp and detailed images in full 4K UHD resolution. It has a wide viewing angle and its wide workspace allows you to view more web pages, images and text without having to scroll or zoom. The monitor also swivels, pivots, tilts and its height is adjustable. The display comes with four USB 3.0 ports which two of them are fast charge capable, two HDMI ports, and a display port. The monitor has a sleek yet sturdy build, coupled with narrow bezels, a sleek black slash silver design, and it blends in perfectly with the setup. This is a beautiful monitor, which is sure to make your work a lot more easier on the eyes. Now, powering all this up, we have the Microsoft Surface Book. This is the first generation Surface Book which I've had for about a little bit under two years. This is a great laptop with a lot of processing power. This specific model is a 256 gigabyte Intel Core i7, eight gigabytes of RAM, 13.5 inch laptop computer. It has an output resolution of 3000 by 2000. And what I love about this laptop is that it connects to the monitor via a single HDMI out cord. You simply plug the laptop to the monitor and watch this bad boy power your whole setup. Now, to complement the Surface Book, I had to go with the Microsoft Surface Keyboard and the Microsoft Surface Mouse. They both offer a sleek, simple design with a soft gray finish. The keyboard and the mouse connect to the laptop via Bluetooth, but unfortunately, they are not rechargeable. They both use a AA battery, which should last you about a year. The keyboard feels great, it has a great key travel and is comfortable on the hands. The Surface Mouse has a sleek, simple design. The metal scroll wheel feels solid and the shape of the body fits perfectly in my hands. It is very smooth and the click feels nice. Matching the Surface Book with the Surface Keyboard and the Surface Mouse was really a no-brainer. So now to get great quality sound on our setup, what better than to go for the Bose Companion 5 multimedia speaker system. Hookup to your setup requires only a single USB connection from the speaker system to your laptop. The digital 5.1 audio playback brings music, games, movies, and other 5.1 encoded material to life with much of the performance you'll expect from a 5 speaker system. The control pod is within easy reach and it houses volume controls, single touch mute, headphone jack, and a connection to a second audio source. The speakers look amazing. They come on a dark gray matte finish that also goes well with the setup. I love these speakers guys. I get great quality sound when I'm working on my videos or simply when I'm around the house and I wanna play some Spotify. Now, as you guys can see, also under the monitor, I have a Samsung Dex station. The Samsung Dex converts your phone into a desktop computer. By docking your phone, the phone will launch a special Dex software onto your monitor. If you guys want to know more about the Samsung DeX, make sure to check out my full review on the link below. Now I also keep nearby a Rode NT-G2 condenser shotgun mic attached to an on-stage tripod boom 
microphone stand. I use this mic setup for all my voiceovers or any other videos where I need good quality sound. It is a great mic, I definitely recommend it, which I'm actually using to record this video. Now, what is a desk setup without proper lighting? Here we have two Hampton Bay 8.5 inch silver metallic accent lamps, which features a frosted crackled glass shade. I paired these up with two Hughes light bulbs to be able to change the mood and the color accordingly. I love being able to change the mood depending on the time of day or what kind of work I'm getting done. Also guys, let me not forget, no desktop setup is complete with an awesome pair of headphones. Here we have the Beats Studio 3 wireless noise canceling headphones, which are great for video editing or listening to music. I have them hanging on my right side under the desk so I can easily reach out and grab them whenever I need them and they rest comfortably whenever they're not in use. The cherry red color definitely stands out against the black and gray finish of the desktop setup, but that's exactly what I was going for. Just like the Samsung DeX, if you guys want to know more about the Beats Studio 3's wireless headphones, make sure to check out my full review on the link below. And last but not least, we have a beautiful metal canvas of the moon that I bought at Ikea. It has a silver black matte finish that looks perfectly and works well with the setup. It fits the theme exactly and it makes the workspace a lot more comfortable. This was definitely the icing on the cake. So there it is guys, I hope you enjoyed my desk setup tour for 2018. I would like to mention that if you guys like any of the products that I mentioned on this setup tour, I will be sharing a link on the description down below so you guys can go ahead and purchase these yourselves. If you found this information useful for your next desktop setup, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, write a comment on the section below, let me know what you guys have to think about this setup, and subscribe to my channel for future unboxings, desktop setups, tech reviews, etc. This has been your boy Juan, and I hope I'll see you guys on my next video. Peace!